CM Punk has retired is uh, what the word is coming out from uh, his ex-girlfriend, Natalie Slater. Uh, that's CM Punk's ex-girlfriend and close friend of him. Uh, supposedly, they're still good friends. Um, in a column that was posted for Red Eye Chicago titled, My Friend is Famous and It Sucks. My Friend is Famous and It Sucks is the name of the title. Interesting. Uh, without mentioning him by name, uh, Slater writes, My friend can't go to Target. He can't go to Great America, the grocery store, or any mall anywhere. It's been a long time since I've seen him escape a restaurant without getting uh, Instagrammed by diner uh, diners and nearby tables. Um, people mob him in the airport, tweet argue, uh, angrily when he doesn't stop and sign autographs because he has a flight to catch. My friend is famous, and it sucks. She also discussed her friend getting mobbed everywhere. Now he's the now he's the recently retired seven-time world champion, and he's one of the most isolated people I've ever known. A few weeks ago, he uh, he found a young fan and his mom cramming Easter candy into the mail slot of his front door. Just before that, he walked out of his back door to throw out the trash only to be met by fans camped out in his alley for hours just to see him. Uh, she added that she she added that seeing him has uh, bastardized her childhood uh, mentions of fame and that she uh, secretly glad it's him and not her. Um, you know, so you know, I like CM Punk. You know, he's he's an he was an awesome performer and a wrestler. You know, personally to me, I don't get starstruck. I'm not, if I uh, see CM Punk or John Cena or one of these other prof uh, professional wrestlers in public, I'm not gonna be a dick and I'm not gonna go up to him and uh, be like, hey, sign a dick. I'll go to an autograph session where they do autograph signings. Uh, you know, for people who want to get autographs, leave them alone. You know, CM Punk, if he wants to retire, you know, let him retire and leave the guy alone. If he wants to come back and perform for us, he'll come back and perform for us. You know, it makes me sick that people get this fascinated with people. You know, I understand the fatuation and such, but really, leave CM Punk alone. CM Punk wants his space. He wants to be left alone. That, you know, maybe that's what it all is. Is that, it, you know, it's just gotten to him too much. That too many people, you know, are bugging him too much. You know, he's a human. You know, all wrestlers are humans. All actors are humans. All singers are human. You know, they're just, or they're really, honestly, just ordinary people. You know, it's ridiculous that, you said that there would be people that would just sit outside CM Punk's house just to see him take out the trash. If you're just there to see him take out the trash, get a life, okay? Uh, this is my rant about CM Punk. Uh, retiring, you know, and people that like actually sit there and watch him fucking take out the trash. Yeah, I just dropped an F bomb. I normally don't, but I'm upset and it aggravates me. You know, he's, you know, he performed for us. He gave his body and his life and his time to perform for us and do something that he loved and he liked, you know, but it's, it's just crazy that people, you know, that stalk him and that, you know, they can't leave him alone. It's like, let the guy live his life. You know, if he goes to a hockey game or a baseball game or something, don't freaking go up to him and ask him for autographs. If you want, if he wants to sign autographs, he'll go to a freaking, uh, he'll have an autograph session, and you can go and get an autograph from him at an autograph signing. You know, so there you have it. Uh, CM Punk, you know, if you end up watching this, um, good luck to you. You might end up having to do what I read, something you wanted to do one day was to move out into the mountains. Uh, you know, so anyways, there you have it. Uh, it sounds uh, pretty interesting. And uh, I guess uh, my prediction of uh, CM Punk being in Chicago at Payback uh, is wrong. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. But uh, from what it sounds like, CM Punk just wants to be left alone to live a normal life. And there you have it.